Pretty, pretty fantastic start to your UFC career, man. 3-0. <laughs> you know, give, give me an idea. I mean, I got to imagine you're feeling on top of the world right now. Uh, very much so. You know, um, it actually just hit six years exactly since I've been a pro. So um, to finally be where I need to be, to be successful, take care of the family, it's perfect. It's perfect. The start that you had in 2018, all the success you had, I wonder, I mean, did it force reevaluation? You know, I mean, I, I think when, when, when people get to the UFC, they want to prove they belong there and, and get there, right? I mean, to have that kind of run, did you have to start setting new goals for yourself and evaluating where you could be? Yeah, definitely setting new goals and then not even that, just, um, you know, I uh, always said once I got here and I proved it, my confidence was going to grow. And once my confidence grew, everybody else was going to be. It's going to be in trouble. <laughs> you feeling that? I mean, um, is that confidence is building? Man, man, the confidence is way up there right now. Give me an idea now. I mean, this opportunity, I mean, you're in, you're in a co-main event already. You know, I mean, what's, what's, what's the feeling like for that? Uh, you know, just to you know, definitely stay focused on the task at hand, but still go out there and put on the show, be dominant, and, um, you know, make a statement so I can get whatever I ask for in the future. What do you think about the matchup itself? On paper, I think, you know, Elizu in your style, they, they, they look like it could be a lot of fun. I mean, I don't know if it's fun to be in a battle. Like that, but I mean, from the outside, it should look fun. It, 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 I mean, it's <laughs> definitely going to be a, f a fun one to go back and rewatch. But, um, you know, with, with his style, anybody who. It, it doesn't matter any style. If you want to move around a lot, do crazy stuff, stand in front of me, you're, you're in trouble. Because I create my own opportunities in there. So. What did you think when they gave you the matchup? Because it's interesting. I mean, he's had a lot of success, but not much attention, right? So when they gave you the name, were you excited about it? Or did you think, like, oh, I was kind of hoping somebody people, people know a little bit more? No, I was excited about it because I'm, I'm, a, I'm a huge fight nerd. I watch every fight. I watch everybody. So they're not going to um, give me anybody that I haven't seen fight before. Um, so I was excited. So. Would you get, I don't want to say a fan, so to speak, but I mean, knowing that you're oh, a yeah, fighter, yeah, did you yeah, like definitely, style? Yeah, definitely like his style. Um, uh, you know, he fought a guy that I trained with um, quarterly, uh, Sean Strickland, and I, like, I was like, okay, well, if he can do that to him, let's go. Nice. Well, last thing for me, I mean, it's been a great run already. But give me an idea, what are the goals for this year, 2019? I mean, a win and a co-main, I got to think however this goes down, it's probably not going to be a boring fight. Oh, yeah. So, I mean, give, give me an idea, what, what, what the goals, uh, where do you want to move from here? Goals, you know, definitely get this win, get this bonus, take the summer off maybe, and then get two more at the end of the year. Somebody like Wonder Boy or another fun fight, Wonder Boy or Teal. I'm smashing both. Why you want to take the summer off? Uh, I, got, I, got, I got some big plans for the summer. <laughs> some big plans for the summer. <laughs> it's a secret. It'll, it'll come out eventually. Right. Just for now, for now, it's a secret. <laughs> we'll leave it under. <laughs>